You ask me about anesthesia. Is anesthesia scary? Does it work? Does it hurt? Can you wake up? And I'm here to tell you anesthesia is scary. Why is it scary? It's because you're asleep. What's the scariest part about being asleep? Well, it's that somebody is going to go inside your body and take something out. If they're not going to take something out, they're going to connect one thing to another. They're going to burn holes inside your body everywhere that you bleed. And while that's going on, you're going to be asleep. You're going to be paralyzed. You're going to be on life support. You're going to have a machine breathing for you. You're going to have feel pain, but you're not even going to know it. The hardest thing about anesthesia is that during surgery, your body goes through a stress test. What do I mean by stress test? Your heart is going to pump faster. Your kidneys are going to get affected with the urine output. You're going to have a stress test on your lungs, on your brain, on your muscles, and every other part of your body. It's like your whole body is going to go through an entire stress test. The crazy thing about it is you're not going to remember it or you're not going to feel it. However, you're going to be on essentially life support. And that will be for the duration of the surgery, before the surgery, during the surgery, and after the surgery until you wake up and you're able to breathe on your own. So what can you do to be safe, to feel safe? What you have to do is talk to somebody like me, an anesthesiologist. We're there to make sure, like a pilot, that you take off, you cruise at altitude, and you land safely. We see all the complications. We train with the surgeons. We went to medical school with the surgeons. We did residency with the surgeons, and we know the surgeons. We know where your body's at. We know what procedure you're going to have. We know how the surgeon operates, and we know what's going to be the end result. Because of all that, we know how to guide you safely from beginning to end and afterwards through your surgical procedure. This is why having an anesthesiologist at your surgery is very important. Because above all, we have the same training as the surgeons. And when your body is going through a stress test and you're going to have all sorts of complications, you want to have somebody there who can handle any sort of catastrophe that comes your way. So when you get to surgery, you get to the surgery the morning of, you're going to go to surgery, take a minute, ask the anesthesiologist, ask them what their plan is, ask them what kind of complications can happen as a result of the anesthetic, and also ask them what you're going to do specifically to help you during the surgery. Because that's why we're there. We're not only there to take care of you, we're there to make you feel better. And this is probably going to be the worst day of your life. Anytime you go over surgery, it's the worst day of your life, unless you're getting new breast implants or a butt lift. If you like this kind of information, give me a follow and click the like and share buttons so that I can get some more publicity on my page.